don't know. Today is June 18th, 2023. I'm Laura. I'm Brenda. And we are back for floss tube and my Diet Coke has a lid on it. <laughs> so anyway, we're ready and happy Father's Day. Yes, Take happy Father's there, Day. So. Mm -hmm. Well, we've had a good two weeks. We, we, well, yes, we have. You yeah. especially, because yeah. you were at Bristol weekend. Yes, I was. It was phenomenal. It looked like it. it was very, you know, anything at the attic is just great. And if you have it on your bucket list, do it sooner rather than later. Because you will not be disappointed. No, so. it's fabulous there. Yes. yes, and it was not as hot. It was only in the low 90s. So mm -hmm. it was... Jean ordered up perfect weather for us Midwestern folks, mm -hmm. and it was great. And Good. I'll show you some of this stuff when yeah. we go along. We want to see. So, yeah. There's a lot. There was a lot to see. Good. And it was a lot of fun. Good. It was just a lot of fun. So, anyhow. Okay. Well, let's just go through all the stuff that we have yes. around us here. We're in a different location. We have a little bit more space, and we yeah. have a table behind us. So... Mm -hmm. We'll be good. So, yes, you start. Okay, well, here's my June. Pardon my in your face. No, it's okay. <laughs> in your face. <laughs> um, okay, so while Brenda was gone, I just foffed about because I couldn't <laughs> I get. I see that. Yeah, foffing about. Foffing about. <laughs> I couldn't settle on anything. It was just like all over the place. So, um, this is my two weeks of whips. Oh my gosh. Oh, I can't wait to see. Yeah, I would pull out something and I would love it. And then I would, you know, then whatever. Who knows yeah. what happened? I can't explain it. You know, you yeah. know how it is. Yeah. All right. So in no particular order, I just pulled out things. Oh, I know this one I pulled out because, well, this is by Beth Twist from Heartstring Samplery. And she had, uh, she was at a retreat at Hobby House. That looked so fun, too. A little bit of rock and roll and a little bit of sampler. Yeah, it was so cool. And that sampler that she did for them, mm -hmm. which I love, is going to be available and we can order it. If, uh, June, July, July 1st. 1st. Yep. Yeah, 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 yeah. So anyway, so that's very exciting. So um, I pulled this out because I had started this and I thought, oh, I'll pull this out and I'll just finish it. And of course, no, 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 no. But it's very fun to stitch on. In fact, the other night I was like, you finish that lady. And that's where she ended up. She's half a lady. Yeah. So this is on 40 Count Hog Bristle by Fox and Rabbit uh, with the called four colors. Um, did I say 40 Count? Yeah, one thread over one. I'm being mm -hmm. professional now. I'm saying all the, the things. All the things. Yeah. And it's pretty good representation of color. Is it? I didn't want it to be, we're facing east. I didn't want the. Oh, yeah, that is very good. Mm-hmm. So this is very fun, and um, I love it. But, so I just didn't finish it yet, but okay. that's okay. And it's in a professional bag. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. What what caught your fancy next? Yes, what caught my fancy next? Okay. Who really knows if this was next, but yeah. Then I pulled out Aline Sachet, 1921, by my friend Becca. Sambri Stitches, which Becca gifted, uh, we went to Jody's house last November for a day of stitching, and this was a new chart from Becca, so she gave it to us with uh, the call for red and green DMC, and oh yeah, I should say what numbers they are, because some people would like that red, it's a really vibrant red, it's number 847, 817. <laughs> don't have glasses on and the green is this number 3818 yes okay thank you so on that same day um jody was just about to launch her linen at uh, cedar river linen and designs so she gave us a piece of what we picked I picked 40 count Albarium and started it that day. And I still haven't finished, obviously. Well, that's but pretty. Looks isn't great it? great on there. Mm -hmm. This color is like the most perfect white to mm -hmm. stitch on because it's not stark white. Yeah. It's, you know, it's just really pretty. Mm -hmm. So I stitched on that for a while. Fun, very fun. 
Okay. Can I give you your job back? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> okay, then the other day, I was in a very hats mood. So I pulled out Rosa Sugars and I thought to myself, well, I can finish that. Yeah, Rosa Sugars is very. I won't say anything. Newsflash, I didn't finish. <laughs> if I had finished, I would have. Finished. That would be the newsflash. That would be the newsflash. If I had finished, I would have had you pull your finished and framed off the wall so we mm -hmm. could show. But anywho, it's good to have choices, right? Lots of choices. Here, I'm just going to do my okay. usual. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm stitching it on with the DMC mm -hmm. that I put on. This is our first version of our floss drops. When yeah. I couldn't wait to figure anything out, so I just took a picture of thread. and <laughs> That was a great... Yeah. I we, miss those. I know. We, we got have... some really great ones this week. Oh, um, yeah. We we'll had show you. Yes. We'll show you. Good. I'm glad you brought yours because mine yeah. are in the other room. Franciscans. Yes. Okay. Anyway. The Franciscan ladies. <laughs> Um, all right, here we go. Here's where I am. This is on 40 Count Tobias by Seraphim. It's, it's very Laura. pretty. I did mine in DMC too. Good. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's very pretty. Mm -hmm. Why did you stop? Uh, squirrel. Okay. A lot of squirrels running around mm -hmm. out there. It was wild with squirrels at my house. <laughs> oh, and this is one of my early Stitch Folk bags. I know. I, I love, love Yes. Barry did a Saju one too. Do you remember that? Yes, yes. I love. I know. That one. Yeah, yes. that's a good one too. Yeah. Here you can touch okay. it. <laughs> <laughs> Here's another Barry bag. Birthday girl, Mildred. Yes. This is what I was working on yesterday. Okay. And uh, I must say, I had a very good time working Excuse on it. Excuse me. Pardon you. No problema. <laughs> this. Is Agnes Lyle by Whilst Iris Naps. Mm -hmm. And it's yeah. fantabulously beautiful. Mm -hmm. And I'm stitching it on 40 Count Brenda's Brew by R and R with the called for overdyed cottons. Boop -ba -doop. I think they're all weeks. Yeah, Christine uses weeks a lot. She used yeah, it in that does. Mary Gibson. Yep. Yeah. yeah. So those are very beautiful. Those are. Mm-hmm. And I worked on this oh, upper that's part, really pretty, which was really fun because it was just like I finished the border over in this boysenberry, mm -hmm. and then I finished this blue border. What, did you say what fabric that was? I love. Yes, it. it's Brenda's oh, Brew by R and R. Yeah, mm -hmm. I love that. Yeah, this stuff down here I had already done. Because I guess at that time I was like, ooh, I want to do motifs. But mm -hmm. yesterday I just wanted to like try and finish up the, yeah. the top part. It's beautiful. Yeah. So unless I see a squirrel, this is what I'll be working on today. Okay. When I get home to watch the race from Road America in Elkhart Lake, Wisconsin. So just in case you wondered what I would be doing. That's it. Okay, then. Oh, yeah. This is a bag by... Christy from Crosshatch Quilts, and of course, it's gorgeous. Mm -hmm. All her bags are. Yes, they are. And this was when I was in my NPI phase, which, of course, I think I'll be in for a long time. So I pulled out Marianne Farmer by the Scarlet House, which I love this. Here's something that just popped into my head. I know Brenda hasn't stitched this yet. Mm -mm. But I could see her starting this, like, soon and finishing it before I do. I have started it. Oh, you did? Because I have it all kitted and blah, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. And I started it. Oh, point. I wonder how far you are. Not very. Okay, well, see. Not very at all. Could. If something happens and she decides to do it. No. It'll be left in my dust. Oh, you have way more done than I do. Okay. Way more. Still, you could finish up before me. Here's what I have done. Thus oh, that's far. so pretty. I like your fabric a lot. Oh, good. I was second guessing mm -hmm, my mm -hmm. fabric because no. in the picture it looks more whitish. Yeah, no, I like your fabric. Okay, I'll tell you yes. what it is in a minute. Yeah. Beautiful. This is with the NPI's 40 count. It's a lakeside. What, I think pecan it's pecan butter? Yes, I think it's vintage pecan butter. Mm hmm. It's very pretty. Oh, very, it's very pretty. So cool. yes. This sampler is so gorgeous. Mm -hmm. It's just amazing. Yeah. 
and this this yellow flower yeah. oh with the blue yeah. vase get yeah. out yeah it's very very pretty yeah show us the mpis oh yeah good idea good idea and i oh, put them dear. on these things is that a needle yeah i had a needle this morning when i was pulling things these out. are the npis oh that's very pretty isn't that nice yeah. this is an older one of tanya's yeah but it is Oh, Nonetheless, have, very, very pretty. I have this thread drop on there that Tanya gave us. That's me, Brenda, Tanya, and Pam. Oh, I love well, that. not really. But <laughs> that's, that's what our, it represents. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> we didn't live back in those times. It's 10 years old. Wow. Mm -hmm. That's amazing. And it is stitched on 40 count vintage pecan butter, as we mm -hmm. mentioned previously. Okay. Thanks so much. Pat Evans from Lakeside was at our retreat mm -hmm. with her granddaughter. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, it was really cool. nice. Her granddaughter, her granddaughter she was stitching. Yes. Oh. Yes. She was super nice. That's super cool. sweet. Yep. That's cool. Okay. Thank you. While you were at Bristol, I pulled this out to be akin to you. This is in a French general fabric bag made by Christy Crosshatch Quilts. And it houses the most wonderful Mary 395. Mm -hmm. So you were at Bristol, and I was like, oh, I should be stitching on a Bristol. And I had started this eons ago, and so I got her out. She's five hands across the sea. And I'm doing her in, oh, what is this? Schoolhouse, Schoolhouse Red. Red. Yeah. Not that, not that cute. Mm -hmm. And that's my tomatoes. Is it? Who mm -hmm. made this? Becky. Becky, socks for mom. Yep. And she yep. used the picture mm -hmm. of your tomato. Oh, that's cool. I think. Maybe Maybe it's not. Maybe. She did use no. one of your pictures of yes, tomatoes. This isn't it. This is someone else's. I think it's Lori Mischievous Stitches. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, I think I have that one with yours. Okay. okay. I worked down one time, mm -hmm. you know. I like that fabric. What is that? I've got to look because I didn't write it. Oh, I know. I have a new system. New system, and I did employ it on this. When I start a project now, I'm going to write on the chart what the fabric is because otherwise, if I write it in my book and then come back to it three years later, I don't know what it is. So mm -hmm. this is, oh, it's Lakeside, 40 Count Lakeside Exemplar. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. Yeah. Beautiful. So beautiful. I did a little bit more on that. After being at the Bristol weekend, mm -hmm. I want to stitch all these Bristols oh, because yeah. of this. Yeah, I'll go into it later. Okay, it's, all right. Well, don't forget, because no. that's important. There was somebody there. Her name was Erin, and she finished either this one, Mary 395, or Harriet Salt while we were there. Oh, wow. It was incredible. Nicola got to see, got to see it. She got to show Nicola. It was awesome. It was just awesome. That is a moment in time. Mm -hmm. That's mm -hmm. so cool. And look, while you were talking, I put it away myself. Wow. That's I'll keep talking. <laughs> Okay. Oh, I love this bag. Yeah. This is another bag from Christy Crosshatch Quilts. And it's using Lori Holt's Granny Chic fabric line. And look at the back with this yeah. uh, embroidery stuff that Lori did. Oh, I love it. I love it. Yeah. yeah. Love. And I forgot what's in here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I was going to be monogamous with this the minute I got it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I love this so much. It is so good. It's, the cuckoo just went off. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Anyway, this is Alice Williams, 1838 by the Scarlet House. Right now, it's a club piece from the country sampler, so you had to have been in the club. Mm -hmm. But a year from now, it'll be released to everyone. Mm -hmm. And I have been fortunate, we have been fortunate enough to see the original, and I've loved it. Look at the lady with the umbrella. I mean, the whole thing is just fabulous. And it came kitted with 40 count fox and rabbit baked clay with over dyed cotton. So that's mm -hmm. how far I got. Yeah, it's got like a double border on there. Yeah. yeah, it's just phenomenal, phenomenal. But, you know, I don't know. I, have, I haven't been able to stick focus? with Focus? Yeah, focus. No, focusing okay. has been occurring. But it's in a very special bag, and mm -hmm. it shall come to the fore again. Mm -hmm. Okay, last thing I worked on. 
was. I don't know. Oh, this is a cool bag. This was made. I bought this fabric. Is this Blackbird fabric? I don't know. I don't but write. Belinda made the bag, yes, right? Yes, Belinda from Blue Ribbon Designs mm -hmm. made the bag. She makes amazing yes. bags. Yes, Yeah. Amazing. I just bought one of hers. I didn't send her the fabric, but she had some for sale on her Etsy shop, mm -hmm. Blue Ribbon Designs. Mm -hmm. And I bought one, a smaller one. Oh, cool. It was really, yeah. I still have fabric to send her, but I'm the worst at sending stuff out. Okay. okay so um, what what oh, this, tell is that? This is, again, another one when Beth was at Hobby House. I was like, ooh, I want to look at all my heartstring samplery patterns. So I did. Oh, this is Mercy Meganson 1849, which mm -hmm. is just an amazing reproduction sampler. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's just too much. So... I'm doing it on 40 Count Milk Chocolate by XJU Designs, which I bought at Kitten Stitcher. And, ah, uh, yeah, it's gorgeous, mm -hmm, right? Mm -hmm. Just absolutely stunning. Mm -hmm. I love the colors because they're different, like the aqua. Yeah, yeah it's and, very different. Yes, I mean, very, there's very like different. an orange in here. And from the antique here that's what it looks like was done so mm -hmm. it's not like she changed anything no. I that like is that. a good one yeah and i think no i know hobby house needleworks right now has a trunk show of this yes. i don't know if this is there but if you can go to hobby house and see best trunk show yeah. get, o get over there yeah yeah Ooh, i like that a lot yeah yeah it's really good and fun to stitch so, that's what I worked on for the past two weeks. Okay. Whoop. You did a lot. I know. I was just boffing about. Yes. It was fun. I didn't stitch a lot. Okay. Yeah, because you were gone. I was gone, and I did put in more than 10 stitches at the retreat. That's so, amazing. That's amazing. That's amazing. So, let me tell you what I was working on. I felt like a slacker, because here I am working on this little small sitting next to Nicola, who's whipping up a sampler for us future release yeah yeah it was a beautiful sampler. Mm -hmm. anyways so what i worked on was this and i will finish it soon so i can send it off to my buddy joy <laughs> um this mm -hmm. i love it and this is where i'm at I love that you're in the scattered seed sampler mode. Yeah, it's I so just fun. love them. It's so fun. That is cool. And this is on some kind of, I think, seraphim. I'm not sure. Doesn't mm -hmm. matter. It's a 40 scrap. count. Yeah, it's whatever. So I have That's this. Exciting. Is it almost done or no? Not really. Yeah, kind of. I mean, it's a small, so yeah. you could finish yeah. it. Yes, I could. And I will soon. So, recapping. So, yes, please recap. So, let me show you my, um, I'll put that on the floor too, my book of days because it's sad. <laughs> it's a sad book of days. So, here we are. Ooh, it's cute though, the way you have it decorated. Yeah. You'll see when I was at Bristol, nothing happened. But we did get this sticker from Molly and Kathy, Linens and Scraps, and that sticker is from the sampler, Bristol sampler, that Kathy model stitched for Claudia. Oh, cool. So is that I an put anchor? that. No, I think it's a, <laughs> I oh, think sorry. it's a cross. Oh, okay. I think. Yeah. I'll show you when I show you the chart. So anyways, I didn't do a lot of stitching. So I did work on that. And I'll put this. Down. You were stitching adjacent over the last couple of weeks. Yes. <laughs> so then I worked on that one. And then I pulled mm -hmm. out um, Every Opening Flower by Brenda Gervais. I love this one. And I've seen um, Sandy, which is S underscore stitching. She just got this back frame from Rental Studios. And it is stunning. Stunning. Mm -hmm. And I saw this morning that our friend Justine is working on this as well. So... Mm -hmm. And, and, you did, and you saw, did you see Lisa Smith's finish of it? Yes, when yeah, we were there in April. Yeah, yeah. Yes, yes, and it was gorgeous. Mm -hmm. So here is where I'm at. 
Wait, did you just start this recently? No. No. Okay. I had I picked it back up. That's so beautiful. I finished the beehive and mm -hmm. the circle and did some letters and went took the border down and I'm over here there's a bird that's gonna go here. So anyways. I stitched on that. And that would be it. And here is my thread. Ooh, in a naughty fashion. In a naughty, naughty fashion. <laughs> Now this is in um, the Andrea bag that I got, and I love her portfolio. Mm -hmm. Isn't really? it great for traveling? Yes. It's perfect. I didn't take it with oh, me, okay. but I love it. Cause I only took one thing with me, my right, little we scattered seed mm -hmm. thing, and didn't work on it. We used to go to retreats and take like 10 projects. Yes. It's crazy. <laughs> okay, so let's talk about the Bristol weekend. Um, first up was, it started Friday night. Let me back up. Wednesday, I got there, and my flight was um, got in at Phoenix time, 1030. My bag was first one off. Ooh. I got my Uber and headed over to the attic. And I had almost an hour and a half before anyone else showed up. Whoa. It was pure heaven. Mm -mm. Pure heaven. I can't even and, imagine. Yes. So then the rest of the day, we were there. Um, the grace came, and it was wonderful. We met, diff you know, people coming in, had dinner at the hotel, blah, blah, blah. Thursday, we went to the attic and met, um, I met Julie Crisave. And her friend Carol, Julie Crisavi, for anyone who doesn't know, runs a lot of Facebook groups and gets exclusives and um, just a really nice person. And it was wonderful to meet her and it, it was great. So then she came in with her friend Carol. Tanya was there and we went to lunch um, and then we went to Tanya's and spent a lot of time there oh, good. Thursday afternoon. Um, it was just... That was fun. It was a lot of fun. A lot, a lot, a lot of fun. It was just the me, Grace, um, Julie, and her friend. And it was just wonderful. By the time we left, it was too late to go back to the attic. They were closed. Went to the hotel, stitched, <coughs> quote unquote. Mm -hmm. And then Friday, um, we went to the attic and then it was so busy there and you know we were kind of done shopping so we went back to the hotel and stitched in the lobby oh, and was it was very very nice and then the event started friday night with dinner and then claudia started claudia is um the most well-versed person on george mueller and the Brist and the children that he helped in the Bristol orphanages. She was just, it makes you so grateful for what you have now mm -hmm. and how this man and his wife helped all these children. It was just amazing, 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 amazing. And she, um, let's see, I'm not gonna do this in, let's see. She provided us with many, many different charts. This one. That's sweet, isn't, isn't that it? that sweet? Mm -hmm. And you could make your name tag, which I didn't, from, see this bunny here? You could make it with different colors, and she provided that with this. And many, many, many people finished it. Not me. <laughs> and then she had this one. And then she had this. This is a small project for your, um, you can make these. This is the paper. Oh, and then these are, are so the cute. designs. Aren't they beautiful? Mm -hmm. And then this was her main. This was a multicolored Bristol. Which is rare? Well, what happens, what she said, is that the girls are taught with a red Bristol. So that's why you see so many red bristols that was 
like the what they had to do. Uh -huh. Then, if they wanted to, they could do another sampler and they could choose their colors. Oh. So this was a second person, a second sampler for this girl, May. Was it for May? No. I guess it doesn't have a name on it. Mm, no. Mary. No, this says my angel's guard, the one I love. Oh, that's so sweet. So <clears throat> what Jean did, you could buy the thread and the kit, so on and so forth. But Jean had these made. And it says, may angels oh. guard the one I love. And it's got Bristol. Mm. Now she had some other ones that said the attic on the end, but our table got these. Um, aren't they beautiful? Oh. It's a beautiful way. It holds 10, which is exactly what, there's 10 in here. You can do it with over dies. You can do it with, you know, DMC. She have a, when this is released. This so. is amazing. Isn't that amazing? Did Matt Twist's husband make these? Yes. Matt Twist made them. And it has a needle minder here at the top. Oh. It's just, it's just so perfect because they stay in there. You know, they're not going to fall out. So yes. And colors. you could like leave a little trail of thread out. Yes. from. That's genius. Isn't that cool? And uh, that's special. Very, 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 special. very special. Wow. So, so this was, oh. um, Kath, this was the piece that Kathy from Needle Linen and Scraps stitched. You saw her stitching oh, she it. She did the model stitching. She did the model for it. And the picture does not do it justice. I'm sure not. It, it doesn't. Wow. Jean also gifted us with this bag. Oh. That's that fun. this was in and so hold on one second because i'm all we're here. holding and don't don't panic or be no. kerfuffled so this was all from claudia here was your name tag that you could make and you know all that one minute to do anything yeah you can put them all in there okay. thank you then we had vicky and megan from needlework press speak and they provided, hold on, I'm getting all my stuff out. No, they provided this, which was amazing. This is called my mini portfolio. And it's a, it can hold little letters. That's what Vicki had in hers, old love letters from her husband. And the chart is on the back, obviously. I'm not going to show you that. But we got all the stuff to make it and finish it. It's done with DMC. Mm -hmm. You stitch it on perforated paper. I want to um, distress this because mm -hmm. I don't want it white. Right. And then she gave us the tape. So you could, this isn't something I'd have to send to Joy. Ha ha, Joy! <laughs> Can you believe it? Joy said, I, think whoop, I, whoop. I know. So anyways, this was really cool. She provided us this tape to go around it so that your edges oh, are, okay. you know, the paper can be kind of, um, could get caught on stuff. Yeah. Anyways, so that was Vicki and That's Megan's. That's neat. That was their Very full cool. kit. Then they had this done in perforated paper. It was a antique and they had the antique there. They had the antique there and wow, knock your socks off. Holy cats. Yeah. It was amazing. Go to Needlework Press on the yes. Instagram. This There's is the antique of it. right here. Wow. And then these are the two pieces. So they're framed together. Yeah, the mm. antique is. So I got... We couldn't figure out at the attic. Jean had these. Hmm? Um, you were like, what are those yes. for? Yes. What are those for? Well, we hightailed it over to the attic and <laughs> got the threads right after class was out. Oh. So for this. And um, these are the beautiful colors. Nice chart. Too. Yeah. Oh, it's yeah. It's just gorgeous. So you can do it on paper or you can do it on linen. And Vicki provided a... I don't know where it's at now, but she provided a guide if you're going to stitch it on linen and different counts oh. of how big it would be, so on and so forth. Okay. So, but it was amazing to think that these wow. have survived um, 
as paper all these years. So great, great chart with in interesting write up, and I'm mm -hmm. sure she will release it in a year yes. or so. Yes, she and then Megan did a class on hem stitching, so we got that. And then Vicki the next morning gave everyone this six red alphabets. I love that. This was a prior release, so this is available. Mm -hmm. Then um, there was two other people there who had released Bristol's at this event. Uh, one was um, Violets and Verses, Jennifer Richardson, and hers was just amazing. Her, um, it was a sweet story because she brought her mother, mm -hmm. and her mother... Um, bought her this Bristol sampler for her birthday, anniversary, Christmas, Valentine's Day, and everything. It was really cute the way she explained mm -hmm. it. And this is the sampler right here. It's just, oh, that's beautiful. cool. I have it. Mm -hmm. um, and if you were to scan this, which you can, you can go and find out all the history of this girl here. Mm. She found her death certificate. She found her um, like acceptance papers into the, the I won't go into all the history of this orphanage, but not every child who was an orphan could get into the um, George Mueller orphanage. And Claudia talked a lot about that. But anyways, then she gave us this little Freebie. Oh, that's adorable. Isn't that beautiful? Yes. Beautiful. Yeah. So that was that was the Bristol weekend in a nutshell. Um, oh, and if we finished our name tags, which I didn't, we were given a gift, which I downloaded, but until I finished my Name tag. This was the gift that Claudia gave us. Oh, that was nice. Yeah. And this little dog here, I think represents, because you see this a lot on them, Queen Victoria's dog, mm -hmm. if I remember correctly. The talk was just fascinating. The documents that she showed of, you know, when they were going to be who was going to put them in the orphanage and you know they had to have their vaccines to get in they had to it was just many many different things it wasn't just like dropping a kid off at an orphanage there was more involved to it than that so it was amazing then um these were given to us by nicola hands across the sea uh, mrs campbell you can't buy these these were our only were given at gifts yes then there were other little tidbits. I'll show you what um, the rest of what um, the attic Jean gave us. This is by um, the Sue, the frippery. Mm. Mrs. Uh, no. Minnie McBeans. Yes, Minnie McBeans. Thank you. Fripperies. This says, can you read it? It says joy in oh. there. That's my word of the year. Perfect. Mm. And then here's the little angel. So they go with oh, Claudia's. Sweet. There's angel's wings. There's heart. It's just perfect. That is beautiful. Just perfect. So mm -hmm. that was a gift from Jean. Um, these oh, are cool. thread drops. And they are plastic. Um, let me see. Hold on. Because they're all plain except for one of them. Here it is. It says... Attic Needlework Bristol oh, 3. Cool. Uh, and these are really nice. I don't know the, if Kathy made these. Kathy Ray, because oh, she does yeah. a lot of... I bet she did. Yeah. Those would be great red, for a red sampler. Just put up all your red threads on exactly, there. Exactly, because you can't... They're all the same. You can't write on it. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. That would be fun. Isn't that cool? Mm -hmm. And then Jean um, gave us this. A little red... Tape measure. That's sweet. Love that. And I think that was it with the, and then of course this. That. So, yes. Um, mm -hmm. Then I got we, Mrs. Flossie. She has a little red sampler. She passed these that out. She was there for the Saturday evening event. 
Did she um see? She sure did. She's so good at that. She is. Mm -hmm. We're gonna sashay down to the from one end of the room to the other. Did She's, you? No. <laughs> I didn't. Um <laughs> then Shelly from the um Shelly Milan was from Texas. She represents the Tudor Rose Sampler Guild. Mm. And I'll get to her story in a minute because that is amazing. Um and then Grace gave me a bag. Oh, that was Isn't sweet, that nice? Grace. And this little, I love these journals. Mm -hmm. Just empty journal. That's nice. And there was um, Sherry Colorado Cross Stitcher gave me a beautiful uh, project bag, which is downstairs. I'm sorry I didn't pull it out. Um, it was the people that you got to meet yes, and talk people. to and hang out with. Yes, it was that is what a retreat's about. Mm -hmm. And I kept, people were saying, why aren't you stitching? And I said, because I can, I can stitch, stitch at, at home. home. Yeah. Yes. I want to yeah. go around and look yes, and talk. And see and everybody's yeah. set up and what they're stitching on and all that stuff. That's, you know, for me making 50 stitches, that was... 50 uh, or 10? Well, it was more than 10. Okay, So I'm good. calling it 50. Oh. So, anyways. 50. So, what did I get while I was there? Yeah. Yes. Oh. yes. Woo, woo. So, first of all, this oh. was in my bag. And I think this is a mistake. And if anyone's watching that didn't get these in their bag, let me know. I will drop them in the mail to you. They're 103s. They look to be for flesh tones for some piece. Um, let me know if you're watching. Let me know. Yeah, if you didn't get your 103s. I will just um, send me an Instagram message, you know, direct message on Instagram, and I will get them out to you. So, Nicola had released um, six things, and I got, you know me, Jean has these up there like candy <laughs> at the checkout, and Rathmel. I love that one. And these are the um, 103s. Then there is Bertha. I love that. Bertha Lausch. Oh, that's a really good one, yeah. That looks fun to stitch. And then Fanny Louise Parker. Look at the birdies. Um, this one I love. Oscar. It's stitched by a boy. And these two pin cushions I got for that. She stitched oh, it on red, red, Aztec red. And I decided if Nicola and several other people can stitch in the middle of this um, conference or ballroom, whatever you want to call it, with hardly any good light or whatever, I can do 56 count with a magnifier. So on red, on red. Oh, okay. Let's see how that goes. The gauntlet has been yes. thrown down. So we'll see. I like, I love I this. I love that. Yeah. Love this. So, so that's beautiful. beautiful. And then this one, I love this. This is Elizabeth stunning. Fitch. Yeah. Oh, here's the threads for Oscar. Aren't they fun? So fun. So fun. And then Elizabeth. And here are her colors. Check out this hot pink. Whoa. Is that so cool? So cool. And then oh, yeah. Alice Park. Mm -hmm. And here are the thread colors for Alice Park. We made a couple substitutions. Mm -hmm. um, and Carolyn helped me with that. Because mm -hmm. one, they didn't carry anymore. Mm -hmm. And, you know, it's... Don't get all... Are fine. Yeah. Don't everybody get their pants I, in a oh, I, I love this border. And I mean, I love the whole thing. I, these are so cute in the middle yeah. of, on the sides. It's just... I, I love the dog. I know. The dog and the Look little... Look at yeah. him. The dog and the boy and the girl. Yeah. And the then... I showed this yes. one. Yeah. Mary, Mary Cornwall. Okay. This is a fun stitch. If I ever saw one in my life. First of all, we got one of my favorite borders. I love that border. And oh my gosh, yeah. Oh, I love the A B C D E F. Yeah, this is definitely 
going to have to happen soon. So cool. We're falling apart. Uh-oh, oh, you're falling apart. Yeah. I'm going to pull out some stuff. Okay. okay. So then... Mary Cornwall. Isn't Nicola from Cornwall? Mm-hmm. Oh, that's cool. Mm -hmm. Okay. So Here, then... this is yours, too. Okay. Woo! That was fun. Oh, that's not the end. Oh, Yay. no. Yay. That's not the end. So then... Here's my haul. Can you get it? You need yeah. help? No. It needs I longer need, arms. I need longer arms. You know, we're at a table that's bigger than our normal table. Mm -hmm. So, anyways. Okay, so this zigzag lamp. They sell these at um, Hobby House and the Attic. And everyone was buying them. And... Um, this is from Native Lighting. It's a company in the UK. It's and, so light. Yes. And it opens up like mm -hmm. this and this. And it has a little tray here. And let me see. Mine's... Oh, yeah. yeah okay. I charged mine too. It's, it's you really You can't good. tell. It's really good light. And light. I was still using this with my magnifier. So I had another light and then my magnifier. It worked perfectly. Yeah, it's really nice. So this um, you can get from the attic or hobby house. Yeah, they're made in England. Yes, by Native Lighting. And this is what they look like. And this is gonna help a lot when we travel. Yes. Because it's everything so else I have yes. is not like this compact and light. Now what I also ordered when I was at the retreat from Amazon, I ordered a battery pack so that you can charge oh, you? any kind of, you know, Ooh. this is a like USB. A C. No, it's not a USB. It's oh. a C um, plug. Did, all different, you know, because the iPhones have different yeah. plugs, but this has all, I should have brought it out. It looks like a, um, about this thick. Does it help just you or the people at your table? Just me. Oh, okay. I'll and it's like this size, but yeah. it's thicker. Uh -huh. And then it has all these cords that come off. So there's a USB cord. There's one to charge your phone. Ooh. There's one to charge your iPad. You could charge this. Yeah. Um, it's fabulous. So anyway, okay. we need that. So. so you don't have to have any cords going no. anywhere. No, just no. Just from that, not to the outlets. Right, okay. Y'all have to charge that, the yeah. thing, but right. yes. Okay. So what did I buy? No, I was there. Yeah. I was pretty good. Uh -huh. I did buy fabric. I put it away and okay. you'll see it. Stitchy Bird by Teresa Kogut. I love that one. That's cute. Yeah. I bought, um, Linda Stoltz was there. Erica Michaels. Mm. And she finished... And was almost finished when we left. The Plum Street samplers, um, the one that Katie Strachan's doing now. Oh, the, the cereal bowl lesson. No, the one before that, that big one mm -hmm. that Katie's doing that has the grass at the bottom and the barn and everything. Yes. Linda, she took it up 10,000 notches. She did hers on silk gauze. And stitched, she didn't like stitching on black fabric, so she stitched this whole thing, full coverage, and stitched the black background. Wow. You'll need to go to her Instagram account and find it, because she did finish it. And it's only like this square. Mm. It is stunning. Stunning. I Anyways. Katie's going to now get some yes. silk gauze. Mm -hmm. So she was there. Look so. out, is this new? Mm -hmm. Alpha Berries? Mm -hmm. Oh, this is genius. This is adorable. Yeah. That's then I got this. This oh, is by oh. Saju. Oh. You stitch this little pot of flowers. One, two, three, A, B, C. And it comes in that. Well, yeah, that's so cool. that. Then I got this Stacy Nash um, piece. It's done, it's a little tangerine almost, orange. So you and stitch that. So you part? stitch this part. Yeah. And then have it finished. Good like retreat that. stitching. Yes, right here. <laughs> then I got this Bristol Berries 3 um, because I got some 5360 linen. 
that I got. Laura got some too. Yeah, Brenda got me some. So I thought, oh, I'll do that on one of those. Then Violets and Verses, like I said, was there. And she had um, these new releases. Um, Marianne Houghton. Mm, that's pretty. The sample, the model was there. It was gorgeous. Just beautiful. And then she had Jane Johnston. I love that one. This was just, it was framed. Um, just pinned around, but then put in a shadow box with flowers around, like silk flowers. So really? it looks, it looks so cool. Yeah, so cool. Then this is her um, Bristol that she charted, Martha. What is it, Martha Warby Warboys, Warboys? And this was amazing. It was there as well. The model. I'm chiming in here now for a mm -hmm. minute. First of all, the charting on this is fabulous. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely fabulous. Secondly, there's a ship and an anchor. So I'm now taking a picture of this so I can order, order it. And <laughs> see, this is some of the um, information she gives you about one of the um, Bristol girls. It's just, again, more information on the back. Then I got this because I thought this was such a different Quaker um, piece. This is I by love that. Um, Sissy Bailey Smith. Yeah. I'm going to get that one too. That's um, gorgeous. Isn't that beautiful? <gasps> the colors are so different. I love it. Yeah, so pretty. Then I thought, okay, if I do well with a 5360, I can whip up this little pair. Mm -hmm. That'd that be one stitch. Primitives. Beautiful. It's beautiful. I got this from Mill on the Floss. And she got me one, too. This, the model was there. And Michelle was there, too. Teddy oh. Cat went mm -hmm. in. Mill on the Floss samplers. So I got that. This, I love that. It's love so it. beautiful in person. It was just stunning. Then um, Linda Stoltz did a um, cute little chart for us to stitch if we want and it was really cool so I'm just going to flash it because it's not the it's just the chart so okay. it says samplers rule oh that's cool and it's got the uh, three crowns after the word rule so you can do it in any fabric any color that was anything. nice of yes. her yes that's cool I mean that's then I got this mm -hmm. I love this this was a retreat piece from a while ago, and Teresa released it. I like this, like, needle book. And, well, I have another interjection. Yeah. Yes. One time, my mom gave me a dustpan like this, mm -hmm. and like I was like, Mom, she said, here's this, and I'm like, why do I want this? It was like a vintage one like this. Mm -hmm. And she's like, well, because you told me you wanted to stitch something. I'm like, I had no idea. Well, this must be where we both saw it. Oh, Teresa okay. Hogan, yes. On one of her videos. Yeah. So, Mom, yeah. you, thank you. She knew ahead of time. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Then, um, I'll do this one last. Then, this was sitting on the counter. Oh, boy. Well, that's... Like this. Yeah. I didn't know what the chart was, but I was like, I just saw whatever, it. this is beautiful. What's the chart? I want it. Is it for sale? Yes, yes, and yes. And it's Jan Hicks. This, um, it's a French sampler. Yeah, French antique sampler. Louise Chapu, C-H-A-P-P-U-I-S. Oh, gorgeous. get out of here. And um, the attic did a conversion to 100 threes. Isn't that amazing? amazing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, this you could get, and if you want the conversion, call the attic, and they will provide it for you with the purchase of the threads. So, Woo. Then the last thing, this was really cool. We went to breakfast Friday morning, Grace and I, and um, went to one real close to the attic, and we were sitting there, and in walks Shelly Milan, who I've met her before. She's been to other retreats at the attic and everything. And she was sitting by herself. So I went and got her and said, come on, sit with us. 
So she did, and she told us about her um, Bristol acquisition. And I won't go into the story, but it was just a great story. You know, she talked to her husband about it because she really wanted the sampler that was going up for auction. You had to be approved first to even bid in the auction. Wow. And she got the, the Bristol, and she was so excited. And her friend, Michelle, who is Cozy Egg, did the charting for it. Mm -hmm. And um, some um, Shelly Stitch is almost done with the model on 56 count. Oh, my. I know. It's crazy. And Michelle, I think, did it on 40 count, and it's called 15 Friends. 15 friends. Now, why oh. do you say it's called 15 friends? Because there's 15 references to her friends at the orphanage. 15 of her friends are in here. Wow. So That's special. It was just an amazing story from Shelly. And it makes you want to go home and stitch this. Yeah. Just amazing you were going to tell us before about why you want to stitch a lot of bristols just down. because the stories behind these girls and um you know some of them got out of the orphanage and went on to lead long lives especially for that time some of them lived to in their late 80s early 90s mm. um just the history that can be found from this man and his wife helping all these girls and boys. There was five houses on the Bristol site and how he helped them and taught them things so that they could go out and make a living was just incredible. And you feel connected to these girls when, you know, Claudia had their, um, you know, like acceptance papers, you know, and their, um, vaccination records and what happened to their parents and mm -hmm. you know who was going to take if they did not do well in the orphanage who was going to take them back so to speak and it was just amazing that you want to go and see Bristol it's still there and for the people going to the Great British Sampler Weekend you're going to have a phenomenal time because you get to go there and um, I don't know if that was confidential or not. I don't think so. Not anymore. <laughs> Sorry. Fingers crossed. Yes. Anyways, um, it just, you know, when you stitch a sampler, a reproduction sampler, you can think of the little girls, especially Rosa Sugars, the mm -hmm. four-year-old. Mm -hmm. A four-year-old stitching something like that. And then these um, people in the, Bristol stitching on like 80 count. I mean, it was like bed linen. It was not, you know, and they didn't have the lights like we didn't. They didn't have magnifiers. They mm -hmm. had, you know, it was just amazing. Just amazing. And Claudia is so giving with her knowledge. And if you ever get a chance to take a class from her or a seminar, do it because she's so versed. And, you know, Vicki and Megan with their the paper that they brought into it. Vicki also bought, you'll flip out at this. She bought from GGR the betrothed. The, the betrothed? But, yes. And what? that was stitched on paper. Really? Paper. Did you see it? Yes. Oh. It was pickles. Amazing. Wow. Amazing. I love that one. Yeah. Yeah, Vicki mm. and Megan, you know, have so much to share and they bring it all to these retreats and mm -hmm. Claudia brought all her stuff. Um, Claudia asked that we not take pictures of the antiques mm -hmm. just for, yeah. you know, that, that was her sense. reason and yeah. we respected that. Mm -hmm. And, but it was amazing to see mm -hmm. all this just amazing. Grace finished the betrothed. Yeah. Yeah. And it's seen it on paper. And it was the, uh, that you saw the actual one. Mm -hmm. Wow. And um, were the colors wild like they are on? Yeah. 
Yeah. yeah. Wow. Um, there were pieces, you know, Vicki, when she got it, there were pieces coming off and everything. Yeah. But Sherry Eddington had stitched it as an anniversary gift for her husband for their 30-year anniversary. She stitched it on 56 count. And that was there with this one on the oh, perforated wow. paper. It was just awesome. Wow. So... Sounds like a fun it was. retreat. It was. And yeah. if you ever get a chance to go to a retreat at the attic, go. Yeah. You will not be disappointed. Jean is the most gracious host, and her staff is top notch. Yes. 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 And if there were any issues, and it was funny because the banquet captain at the hotel recognized me and kind of gave me a hug. <laughs> I That's thought, sweet. yeah, they're, the hotel staff is just... Yeah, they are really nice. Yes. Really nice. Really, really, really good. So, anyways. Well. So, that is exciting. It was. <laughs> What's that little thing? Did we see this? Oh, this I got. This is some Tabby Cat wood smoke. Mm -hmm. 46, 46 count. 46 count. And I also got... This was in my bag when I got there. Here's the tabby cap. I got this because I like the color of it. I love it, yeah. For the, um, this one, the angels. Oh, yeah. That, that would be beautiful. Stitched. It was stitched on 40, but the 40 was a different color, so I got the 46. And then this is 103 by uh, Gloriana. So they over Schoolhouse Red. Oh, yes. yeah, cool. So cool. Anyways. Cool. I think I showed some last time. Yeah, so. you got them from Hobby House. Yeah, right? this one I got from the attic. Mm -hmm. So, and they had um, gotten just gotten in Access Commodities um, thread and were stocking it. And mm -hmm. I met, you know, who came over? Just she wasn't in the class, but the woman that you met in April who was came after I was there, Aurora. Oh! She came over with her mom. Oh! And I got to meet her, oh. and it was wonderful. Oh, cool. Yeah, and her mom was there. Were was, they at the retreat? No, at the they store. just came over to okay. the store. Oh, cool. Yeah. Oh, cool. It was so nice. So nice. And there's, you know, so many people you meet, and, you know. Yeah. Oh, get up and nice. walk around. That's nice. Mm -hmm. So... Okay. I think um, I have some more stuff to show, but this came while I was gone. Oh, well, so, what did, what was that? Well, I got this. Yes. Just like Laura did. Love it. Mm -hmm. We saw the antique when we were at Tanya's house. Mm -hmm. And love it. Comes with, you know, everything. It's just country sampler that they had their stitch camp retreat this past weekend. This weekend, really, and mm -hmm. it was amazing, just mm -hmm. wonderful. Then I got this. This is Katie Strachan's conversion for this. It can't, comes with everything. I think she may be sold out of it, but I haven't opened it up yet. Yeah, you can check her website, yeah. Katie Strachan Embroidery. Mm -hmm. You have to have the chart yourself. She mm -hmm. doesn't it's sell a, the chart. It's by Stacy Nash. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Then I had placed an order a while ago from Northumberland House, where Grace got me that bag, and I got these stickers. Oh, fun. And I got, ooh. Oh, these are, these are not from. Those from Tina? These are from Tina, um, Team Egner on um, Etsy. Are they floss drops? And they're floss drops. Oh my Look gosh. That. Look at that. I can't see one. Oh, these are okay, Tina. These are really, really cool. Aren't so she cool? her shop's on Etsy, huh? Yeah. yeah. These are really well, I mean seriously. No, I, I think these them. were from Northumberland House. These. Oh yeah, because they're her sampler. Yeah. These are very cool. We'll keep one. Oh, oh there thank you. Go. you. She has all different kinds, and she has, like, vintage birds and whatnot. So, go support her. She's yeah, I, just great. I would get the DMC for Harriet Hay and put them on these. There you go. Ooh. There you go. And Thanks. then I got oh, look at this some one. fabric. Oh, that's cool. It's a button card. Like, okay. Then I got this. This is 40 Count Oak from North. I've never tried their Ooh, fabric. Ooh, that looks so. neat, though. I thought that looked 40 cool. count. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. 
And this Gorgeous. one is 40 count sandstone. Now one of them is like a second meaning that there's something wrong with it mm -hmm. but i haven't opened them up to see yeah and i'm sure if there is you can do a small work around it or whatever so i thought i'd try them and they came very quickly you mean lickety split yeah lickety split from the uk mm -hmm. so hmm, that would be it wow that's fun good lord <laughs> Well, I'll show you some haul. Yes, too. please. Okay. Well, we both got our Fox and Rabbit mm -hmm. linen of the month, and this one is Sea Fog, which mm -hmm. has a tinge of green. Mm -hmm. Would be perfect for like a seafaring mm -hmm. sampler of some sort. Oops. Can you hold that? that? <laughs> <laughs> um. Okay. Then. The lovely Denise from Utah um, sent me this. Remember the last week I gave this to Brenda? Well, she said she would. She sent me her chart because because kindness keeps going and going and going. Yes. So thank you so much, Denise. That was yes. so Super so nice. nice. Yes. Yes. So got that. I'm mixing mail and haul. No, you already showed that. I put that back. Thanks. <laughs> okay, um, I got a bag and a thingamabob from Lou and Sue. <laughs> I'll show you the thingamabob. And we'll, I'll, it's a folio. Oh, it's a folio for my 103s. Yes. Okay, so they had this special fabric. They didn't have very much of this. Um, it's by American Jane. I love so, the Scotty dogs. I know. I love them. And my folio, which I'm very hepped up about. Yes of the same fabric they do such a nice job oh it's beautiful and so then i can put my 103s in here i've got to pick out which project i'm going to put in here i'm not sure yet it'll be a hands across the sea something or other mm -hmm. um i just have to figure out which one it is so um oh that reminds me um, Susan Stanley, A Stitch in Time. I was just going to talk about that. Who's part of Lou and Sue. Mm -hmm. ha her latest floss tube has a big announcement about her website, uh, which Google Susan Stanley, A Stitch in Time, and mm -hmm. you'll get to it. Mm -hmm. And this fabulous project that she's going to be doing that is a doll quilt. You can purchase the supplies from her on June twenty second at a certain time. Anyway, eight fifteen. Okay, I've got it. On. I'm gonna do it. Okay, good. I am too. Okay. All I right. just think that. Yeah. Go ahead. I'm sorry. Eight, no, no, no. Chime in. Eight fifteen uh, Chicago time. No, eight fifteen Pacific time. Ten fifteen Chicago time. Yes. Okay. Anyway, go watch her latest video, and she's going to show you all the things that she's doing to make this doll quilt, and it's all based around eighteen forties. What would the fabric look like? What would the supplies look like? And it's hand stitched, and she wants everybody to be successful. So she's yes. going to work with us. We, well, I, let me just say, I do not know how to do any of this stuff, but I'm going to learn. She, she said I could, and yes. she knows me, so she knows. <laughs> I, yes, the way she talked about it, I decided I can do this. Mm -hmm. And it's a small quilt, mm -hmm. and the way she's done it, she has put so much thought and yes. work into it is that yes. everyone can to succeed. Go watch it today. Yes. And then get hepped up and then let's do it. And um, maybe all the people can help us. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. It will be fantastic. So. Yeah. 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 So that's exciting. Very you exciting. Go watch that. Very, very, very exciting. And I'm so ex happy for her. She's, yeah. Yeah. She's, so. yeah, it's very, very cool. Okay, then I placed an old, okay, here. This is all from In Stitches Needlework. Oh. Yeah, in, in Alexandria, Virginia. Virginia. And we have a friend who just kind of knows or finds out or tells us when a shop has lakeside. She has radar. She has lakeside radar. Yeah, and we're and, not kidding. And usually I just go, okay, that's good to know. I've got enough linen. But for some reason or another on that day, I was like, hello, in stitches. <laughs> hello. 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 And so I called in stitches that day. Where's my stuff? Hang on one second here. Oh, here it is. And 
I talked to Becky and it was really fun. Well, let me set the stage. I was at work, <laughs> Hello. of course, and I called in stitches and I was Because what else would you be doing Well, that. That's all of I course. would be doing. So I called in stitches. I talked to Becky and I started placing my order. I said, a little birdie, Penny, told me that you have some lakeside. So can I have a fat quarter of lakeside pecan butter. And she said, yes, we have that. So I'll start with that. That's beautiful. I know. This is like gold. Yes. And then we have vintage maritime white. Oh, that's oh. Penny's favorite. Yes. I love this. So I got a fat quarter of that. Then I asked her if possibly she had this chart because it had been on my mind. And this is I love this one. Marianne Cop, mm -hmm. 1839 by Brenda Gervais. She had it. I said, well, might you have all the threads for such? She did. Then when I was giving her my name, which we all know is Laura Duet, <laughs> blah, blah, blah. And I didn't say anything about like Maud and Mozart or Brenda and the Serial Starter. And she knew who I was. Oh my gosh. I was like, I was at work and I felt like telling all those attorneys and stuff who think, you know, woo woo, they live in, they travel in big circles. Hey, somebody in Virginia knows who I am. Get over here. <laughs> Pay homage. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, it was really fun. Becky and I had a great conversation. Oh, that's wonderful. And look at all the stuff I got. That's so, great. Here, here, thank here, you. Here, thank here, you. Here, thank here. you. Thank you. Lord. Oh, boy. So. I'm going to put your threads in here. Oh, that is a good idea. Mm -hmm. What are you going to, are you going to use one of those linens? I might. Okay. I'm not really sure what I'll use. Okay. So, that was really fun, and I got Lakeside and that. I know. I know. Isn't yes. that amazing? Yes. Yes. Yeah. So, that was uh, exciting. That was very exciting. That was the, I mean, I was Save just, the um, Yeah, I'm card. saving this, yeah. too. Here, put it in. I'll put it in. I'll put it in the, yeah, okay. <laughs> so, in Stitches, Alexandria, Virginia. I haven't been there in person, but I bet yes. it's a good place. Yes. I've ordered from them before for Lakeside. Mm. Mm-hmm. Per penny. Um, it might have been. Yeah. Okay. Is this garbage? Uh, yes. yes. Okay. Brenda's very organized. <laughs> Unlike some people. Thank you for these. I You're like welcome. These. You're welcome. Okay. Um, let's see here. Oh, so, uh, last Wednesday... Some friends of ours that we hadn't met in person, but you know, you know how that is with stitching people, you know them, you mm -hmm. just haven't met yet. So they were traveling from two from Florida, flew to Indianapolis, went to West Lafayette, Indiana, and then were on their way to Stitch Camp. And this is Julie Gulf Coast Stitches and her friend Robbie, and then Madeline from West Lafayette. So they were driving through, and so this time I did not actually invite them to Brenda's house, I did, Brenda did. So, um, they came over, we got some Lou Malnati's, we showed them all around here, and then we sat around and laughed for a couple hours. Yes, Lou Malnati's is a pizza place. Yeah. The pizza place. Deep dish. In mm. Chicago. Yes. Yeah, and know. Robbie's daughter lives local. Oh, and yeah. And she came Allison. over, too. She doesn't do any stitching, really, but she came, and yeah, she just nice. had a lot of fun with us as yeah. well. So, yeah. it was great. And Madeline gave us these floss drops that are mm -hmm. so cool. I love them. Madeline was hysterical. Mm -hmm. She's a bit funny. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we had a really good time. Yes. And, um, yeah, that was great. And we have, um, Laura doesn't know this yet, but I have a special guest coming sometime this week. Oh, you do? To drop something off. Oh. Yes. And I will tell you later. Okay. And then we have another two special guests coming next Sunday. So we may do a floss tube next Sunday, depending, mm -hmm. or it's going to be three weeks. Okay. So but Stand, be on standby. Yeah. Be on standby. <laughs> okay. So, um, let me do this one. Yeah. First. Okay. While we were there, while I was at the attic, yeah. we had, um, Helen gave us this gorgeous card. It's quilling. Yes. Love it. It's gorgeous. Helen. 
Helen. And she said to all the people that are can be not have a life, she <laughs> gave us these two magnets. Yay! So I want to get my husband to put these on a you know big popsicle stick or something <laughs> and hold them up. Yeah. Boop, boop, boop. It's just these are magnets. It was very that was thoughtful sweet. and kind of her. Yeah. Um, yeah. And if Rick can't do it, then we can drive around with these on our car. No, but somebody might take them off. Well, they might need it. I don't know. Yeah. Who I knows? That one. But be kind. I knew yeah. you would. I knew this would be the one that you would like. I knew it. That's hilarious. Yes. We, we'll show something else in a minute. And yeah, we know how to divvy yes. it up. So anyways, thank you very much, Helen. And then I got to meet Anna. Yeah. Stitch Rody. Last week, last time, when I uh, pointed out Anna's floss tube, I forgot that she was going to Bristol. And then now, then you got to meet her. Yes. I didn't even know she was going. She came in mm -hmm. and it was so much fun. She is a hoot. <laughs> and we, we, um, took it. I took an Uber back to the airport with her and Judy and it worked out just wonderfully. So well, that was um, fun. She was lucky. so much fun. Mm -hmm. And she gave me this envelope, a manila envelope, and she said, Don't open it till you see Laura. Well, that didn't happen. <laughs> I'll tell you right, I told Anna right straight up, that's not gonna happen. <laughs> so she gave us a very nice card. Yeah. Very thoughtful card. And she made these and I could easily figure out whose who's was whose. whose. Yes. Look at this. This is like a little um, a, coffee mug. Yeah. But, but we don't drink coffee, so I'm going to use it by my stitching chair to put my water bottle on. Yeah. And this is like English paper piece yeah. little guys around. Yeah. Me. It's so cool. Hannah's so talented. And she was, um, yeah, she was just so funny. I enjoyed meeting her a lot. A lot. So I love this. We shared a couple meals together, and it was great. By the way, Grogu has now been adopted by the Mandalorian, and his new name is Din Grogu, I think. I could be wrong, but now he has a father. <laughs> Move along. <laughs> I love this. Thank you so much, Anna. Baby Yoda. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I thought it was Ding Dong or something. Ding Dong? Well, you just said his father's name changed or whatever. Well, I mean, we all... It's a long story. Okay, then I don't want to I know. know you don't want to know. <laughs> if you know, you know. And if you don't, don't worry about it. Okay. Okay, then we got this beautiful card. And this is from Jennifer in Iowa. And she started an Etsy shop. And it's called Raven's Roost Stitchery. And it's for project bags. Raven's Roost Stitchery. And she sent Brenda and I these great, fabulous corn aren't bags. They, aren't they cool? Because yeah. she's from Iowa. I know. This is and she so put cool. our name and a little, see the raven? Yeah. And her name. That is so cool. I want to put that project uh, by... Hands on design. It's called Knee High by the Fourth of July. Oh yeah, do you that have would be that? Perfect. No, I don't. But okay, I, yeah. yeah, that's the one I want to put yeah. in here. Yeah, isn't that cool? Nice summer project. Oh, it's yeah, I love it. Thank Ravens, you so much, Jennifer. Ruth Saint Stitchery. Thank you. Yes, very exciting new Etsy shop. Okay, all right. Let's see. Okay, let's um, do this first and that last. Okay, our just friend. Just in case there's a catastrophe. <laughs> There's not going to be one this time. Our friend Andrea right now is at StitchCon. She lives in Australia. She's an American who lives in Australia. But you, the aforementioned portfolio. Yes, that was from Andrea. Yeah, she's yes. made us so many things. She is so generous. And it looks like she's having such a great time mm -hmm. at StitchCon. After all those yes. nerves. Yes. There, I, like I, I told everybody, you go to a retreat by yourself, mm -hmm. you don't have to worry. No. You're going to have... However yes. many people are there, that's yes. all your friends. Yes. Because everybody is just cool. Yeah. And before I forget, yeah. Kate came up to me at the shop in the attic. She was so thankful to both of us for helping her through COVID. You know, 
our videos and everything and she was um came i think by herself and everything mm. but by the time she left she left she had made a lot of friends oh, good. And linda clues who i sat oh, with was um she hit it off with linda so oh that's nice so hi kate <laughs> hi kate um, so Andrea's in the States visiting yeah, sorry, her kids and no, no. And going to StitchCon. So, um, she's having a great time, but, uh, a package arrived and it was for me, Brenda and my mom. And it was these, she makes these really cool pin cushions. They're pin cushions. They're bigger than a pin cushion. Yes, they, they're uh, just yes. works of art as yes. far as I'm concerned. Yes, exactly. So she sent six of these and some little darling bags, but um, she didn't specify who was who, but I could tell when I looked at them, like I, I knew which ones my mom would go nuts over. And well, I started with that. Okay. I started with, I know my mom's, I knew my mother would want this one. And I knew my mother would want this one. So mom, yes. these two are yours. So then I said, which ones would Brenda like? And then I picked, well, I didn't pick, but I was like, this one. I knew she would yes, love that. And that's the one. Mm -hmm. And I did not know who. Loved, yeah, I, would, you know, I just put them out. Yes. I'm like, okay, yes. you know, what? how do yes. you want to divvy these up? So this one. And mm -hmm. then I picked this one. And perfect. It mm -hmm. all worked out perfectly. Mm -hmm. It always does. It's yeah, so Yeah, we weird. don't ever argue and fight. Yeah. So mine are. This one, this is some Jay Wecker Fresh. Well, all of these are these three fabrics by that lady. Yeah. And then your mom's baby doll. Yeah. And I like this one because it says rejoice, be exceedingly glad. I love that. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. That's and cool. the sides. Yeah. And the back. Yeah. And just, just they're so, so they're oh, perfect. Yeah. I love so these. Perfect. And when she had shown these on um her I know. Instagram, I always wanted them. Yeah. And now we have two each. Yeah. And a little lamb. Yeah. And my dad used to have a sheep ranch. So. That's cool. Yeah. And I like my little doggy. Yeah. Well, yeah. You doggy for you. And then um, these little, these bags are the best for putting threads in. Yeah. That's what I'm using for yes. my threads. But you should put them on a ring. Not no. just all hunked in there. Then I love this. This is adorable. And, then she, and each bag is a koala bear. It says Australia in his little shirt. And mine's red. Yeah. So and cute. then she has this little thingamabob. And this it's, is from the town in Australia that she lives in. Yeah. And I couldn't begin to say it. Yeah. And just all these charms. The yeah. scissors, the heart. Um, what does this one say? Uh, a koala bear. Uh -huh. Inspire, a koala bear, a heart, and then this little can of where she's from. It's, it's so just... wonderful. I never thought I would have any connection to Australia. And now I have so many yes. connections to Australia. Yes. 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 Oh, it's yes. amazing. Yes. Thank you, Andrea. Thank That's... you. Thank you. Thank you. I mean, seriously, my mother's going to go ape over these. Thank you. Thank you. Thank yeah. you from the bottom of our hearts. So yeah. one day we will meet. Yes. One day. So now what have you what do you have behind you? Oh, I was um do you want me to bring it forward? Here. Yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot this. Joy. I got something back from Joy. This is my uh Pennsylvania Quaker Ooh, pin. That piece. looks good. I didn't want all the yeah. at the top. So Joy finished this. Now let me spin this around. This you had to match up um, the ends of it. She did, or um, you then. did. She did. Yeah. And oh, she did good. Here's can't even tell. I know you really can't tell. And then she put a strawberry She's on the a top. Genius. And this is just gorgeous. I love this so much. And then I just pulled out one of my 4th of July um, little vignettes. I, get, I love this little raggedy end, though. I got it on Etsy. That's sweet. Isn't that sweet? Yeah. She's holding a little fly. That's adorable. Isn't that adorable. And then Aww. all this stuff in here. I didn't stitch a one of these. Oh, really? I bought this stuff. Oh, I did punch needle one of the things down here. But all this stuff I bought... Um, 
This is by Terry, the old needle shop. Oh, nice. Terry, the old needle shop. Mm. These are some punch needle that I bought from Denise Schofield um, in New York. I don't remember where I got those, but um, yeah, I just love it. Mm -hmm. You have a good eye. And little Raggedy Ann. Oh, that's sweet. Sits next to it. I love it. I have another one coming too. What's this Your one? Doesn't know. This is a punch needle Ooh, from Denise. That's gorgeous. Isn't that beautiful? Mm. Um, Denise um, does a lot of work with um, the old tattered flag and does a lot of designing and she's super oh, nice. She and mm. Yeah. And she mm. was selling some of her stuff very reasonably. So I bought it. Anyhow, that's that. Okay. So the, thanks for reminding me. No problem. There, okay. So. Then, then we got a box from... Can you put yeah. that back there? Cause... Thank you. Janet in Jacksonville, Florida. This That's... is mind blowing. Sorry. It is. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're you... okay. So Janet sent Janet isn't even on Instagram, nothing. But you know, so tell them how she found you. Okay, so this is funny. Okay, so she found where I worked from she said from the birthday video that Mike did for me when I turned 60 and somehow on there it must have had the name of the firm and so she called and she was talking to our receptionist to get the address and everything and then I talked to her and I was like oh my gosh that's she's told me what she wanted to send to us and I said oh my gosh it's quilts and um one for Brenda one for me one for my mom Okay, so that makes me want to weep with yeah. thankfulness and yes. so kind to send this to us. We're yeah. so, we love them and we're going to show them to you yes. in a minute. I'm going to yes. stand up and go behind here so that okay. I can open them up Okay, and you can see them. Okay. I'll let you do the opening. Yeah, you just stay there. I'll just stay here. Okay, this is the one she sent to Brenda. And Brenda, how do you feel about this? I, it's perfect. I it is absolutely, it is so me. So me. Look at it's that. It's so cool. Here. What? No, come. Can, see. can you put it over the chair? Yeah. Yeah, okay. yeah, 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 yeah. So <gasps> look at Isn't that. Isn't that amazing? Isn't that so beautiful? And look at the back. The back has that fabric on the back. I and just she, love it. She put a little thing with whose they were for. Yeah. And I think we would have been able to figure this one yeah. out too. So. <laughs> yeah, I think so too. It's just beautiful. It's, I can't thank you enough, Janet. Thank yeah. you, thank you, thank you. It's, I wish it were going to be cold soon, so. Well, you know, you turn up the air conditioning. <laughs> okay, this no. is the one she sent for my mom. And we'll bring it up closer. Yes, yes. I think it goes this, this is way. so Nancy. It is. Because, look at the stitching in here. Yeah, so that's like a vintage embroidery yes. piece that she incorporated in there. It's so beautiful. So and then the beautiful. backing fabric she used could be called Nancy Rose Bates because <laughs> those little pink roses are just right up my mother's alley. Nancy, I hope you're not having an H&H &H right she now. She is. Oh, my goodness. So amazing. So amazing. Yeah. It's just gorgeous. beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. And then the one Janet sent me is using that American Jane fabric that I got on the Lou and Sue portfolio. I think everyone knows you like that American yeah, Jane. Yeah, I know. Look at this. It's so beautiful. Oh my gosh. I love this so much. Yeah. In the back. Okay, here it comes. Okay. Here we go. Got it? Yeah. Okay. Look is at that. that not amazing? And look at these little, see? There's the Scotty dogs again. Yeah. And the little people. Oh my goodness. American Jane is what it's called, right? Yeah. The fabric. The, the, okay. the line of fabric. Yeah. Okay. It's just so beautiful. And then the back is like red work embroidery. Look at that. I it's just. You. We are the luckiest yes. stitchers in the world. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for yes, the thoughtful, Janet, kind thank gift. Thank you. Thank you. I mean, we really, 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 really love these. Mm-hmm. Very much yeah. so. So, okay. So, 
I'm coming back. I know. Just, okay. We'll fold these up when we get done. Yeah. So, that was a good idea to get that table behind there. Yeah, that was a good idea you had. I know. Okay. Well, Rick really did. Oh, so. okay. Thanks, Rick. <laughs> Okay, oh. so that was fun. Yes, that was fun. What else are? Oh, so we have a couple. People yeah, so coming we, next week. So we and, may do something next Sunday, mm -hmm. but if we don't, then it's going to be the Sunday after Fourth of July weekend, which is July ninth. We'll okay. be back July ninth. So. Yeah, but we may sneak in a short one next yeah. week. Yeah. So. Okay. So we'll for sure the next real one will be July ninth. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah. So. Okay. What are we going to work on? What are you I on? have no earthly idea. I really like the one by Beth Twist. I know. Maggie. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I like the one you're working on. The Agnes. Yes. <laughs> yes. So. Yeah. I don't know what I'll do. Maybe okay. I'll work on the Beth one. Okay. Know. Who knows? Okay. Who knows which way the wind will blow when I get back to my chair today? Yes. And I'm going to try to finish that um, little one by Scattered Seed Samplers. Oh, yeah. yeah. I just love her stuff. Love, I know. love, love her it's stuff. really yes. good. And I will work on every opening flower. Yeah. My thumb is getting better. Thank you for oh, all your... Oh, did you your... use any of the tips? I used the chapstick at night. Oh. But um, I also was picking my fingers, and Melissa told me, don't pick your fingers. Well, that sounds painful. Speaking of which, mm -hmm. the goobers are on the air. What does that mean? That means that's what her husband calls us. Oh, the goobers are on the air. And he means it very lovingly. He doesn't mean it because he calls Melissa a goober. The goobers but I are just on think the air. The that's hilarious. funniest goobers. So all weekend long, we were calling us the goobers. So I forgot to bring that up at the beginning. Mm, so funny. I hope he's watching till the end. Mm -hmm. So the goobers. So anyhow. Funny. Okay, we'll have a great couple of weeks. Yes, and if stitch we do, all the things. Yes, stitch all the things, and we will see you soon. Okay, bye. Bye.